Hey everyone, today I've decided to spray paint some Easter eggs. Now I know most people use dye or sometimes a paintbrush or wax resist to color their eggs, but I've just decided to use a good old can of spray paint and see what happens. I'm going to start by taking some masking tape and I'm going to put it on some cardboard. You could put it on um, plastic or metal if you want, or a tile. But I'm just going to layer it like this. Push it down pretty flat, get the wrinkles out. Okay, next I'm going to draw some patterns. You can draw whatever you want on your eggs. Sorry about the chicken. Okay, I've got some circles. And I'm going to draw some stars. Like that. Just draw whatever you want. Okay, next I'm going to take my X-Acto knife and cut around the shapes You want to cut through the tape, but not all the way through the cardboard You're just trying to cut the tape Okay, and then you can peel these off This is the part I don't want So I'm throwing this part away and I'm keeping this part. Also, you can cut out, um, here's my stars, just cut out star shape. And the, on the star shape, the inside is the part I want. Doesn't have to be neat. I mean, you can make it neat if you want. Doesn't really matter though. Oops. Okay, so then you have a little star. Okay, I've cut out all my stars and I'm also cutting out the circles. I'm just cutting around the circles. And then you can pick up the whole thing as one circle. And then you can put that onto the egg. If it comes apart, just stick it back down. That's where the two pieces of tape were. Just stick it right back where it was. Then you have a circle. Okay, take your egg, make sure it's dry, and put your tape designs onto your egg. And when you're putting them on, make sure you push them down really well. Don't crack the egg, but they have to be really stuck. Here's the star one done. Now I'm going to start on the other one. Just going to take these things right here, put them wherever you want. Like that. Smooth them down so that there's no air bubbles. Okay, and when you've got all your circles down, then you take little scrap pieces of tape and you can fill in the cracks between the holes, like uh, right here. And just do that all over the egg. Here's the finished circle egg. Covered it with tape so there's no cracks, I think. And here's my star egg and I'm going to go take these and one more and I'm going to go outside and spray paint them. Okay, here's the star egg. I'm going to paint it pink, this color. Doing this with one hand so... Might not be that great. Gonna let that dry a little bit and do the other side. Okay, now I'm gonna do this egg in green. 
This is a really old color. Uh, you, I don't think you can find this in the store anymore. I think it's called Safety Green. Hope it still works. Okay, I'm going to let that dry a little bit and do the other side. Okay, this is still wet, but I'm, I have no patience right now, so I'm going to start taking the stars off. should probably use an X-Acto knife. You should really wait till the paint is dry. There's a star. Alright, I think that's good enough. I don't need to do the whole thing. Alright, there's the, the pink one. Okay, this one isn't dry either. It's it's very sticky, but I'm just going to take the tape off anyways. Once again, you should wait till it's dry. Because you're going to get fingerprints in it if you touch the, the spots. There's a spot. Okay, here's the finished green egg. Now as you can see, uh, the paint, because it's still wet, I'm getting green spots uh, where they shouldn't be, like there, but, you know, you, it, you would be more careful when you do it. And uh, I will go get the other egg. Okay, the last color I'm doing is Rust-Oleum Metallic, Metallic Gold. This is the paint that I bought to do my my Mockingjay pen with, but I haven't painted it yet. This is going to be the first time I've used it on the egg, and I will see if it's good enough to do on the pen. Wow, it looks nice. Okay, I'm trying to show this out in the sunlight so you can see what it looks like. It's a um, pretty, pretty nice color. Go in the shade. It's a really nice gold. I like this paint a lot. Okay, here's all three of my eggs done. Now, I know I keep saying the paint is not dry yet, and it's not. Um, I keep messing it up. I mean, it, if you watch this, like, see, it's, it's still wet, but I'm just uh, showing you basically how to do it or what it looks like if you decide to do this. You can use hollow eggshells, you can use plastic eggs, or you can use raw or hard-boiled eggs. This one is actually raw. I'm not going to break it to show you, but... Oh, I know, like, you know how uh, a raw egg spins slow, right? And a hard-boiled egg spins fast. This is a hard-boiled egg. It's a real egg. And I will eat it as soon as I get all the shell off. There's nothing wrong with it. The shell does not go... the paint does not go into the shell. Alright, anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Hope you liked it, and uh, see you later.